Hey, what's good? I'm Exec Prolific, and I want to talk to you today about how you can make money off of just seven fans. That's right, seven fans. And what I mean is that you don't need to have 5,000, 10,000, 100,000 fans to see money. As a musician, having a fan base isn't about just the number of fans. It's also about the connection foremost. That's the only way a fan is going to kick money out to you. They have to trust you, feel that you, and, and also like you before they even spend any money with you. So that's just first and foremost. Now, as we understand, artists aren't seeing the majority of their money from record sales, CD sales, or uh, digital downloads. Majority of the money is coming from being on the road, selling tickets to tours, concerts, and merchandise. Uh, so it's all about basically the experience. They're making money off of the experience of music because that can't be bootlegged, that can't be duplicated, and only the artist will be the one to see the money from that money. Uh, no bootlegger, I mean from that from that sale, no bootlegger can 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 do that. Now, being that you're not a big time artist, how can you also do the same? Yeah, you could do shows, but let's say you're not even big enough to get shows and 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 uh, book clubs. You can have seven fans or more and make money as long as you have a connection with those fans. Now, what you can sell to these fans, I mean, yeah, you can sell merchandise, you know, if you have it, but the thing that you can sell that doesn't cost you any money is your time. You can sell uh, time on uh, Google Hangouts, have them pay you for a certain amount of time, and then at that specified time, you guys hang out on Google Hangouts. Uh, you can mail a, a autographed CD if you do have one, and also the video footage of you signing the CD so they know it's authentic. Um, you can you can uh, have them pay you to to have dinner with them. You know, a hundred dollars for your for like an hour, two hours of your time to have dinner with them at a certain spot. Um, uh, a pre-show performance. Let's say you do have a bunch of fans that want to see you perform. You can also have them pay you to have a dinner with you before they uh, see you perform. Or you can do an in-house performance. You don't even have to leave your house. Through Google Hangouts, you could do an in-house performance live. They pay you before the performance, and then at the specified time, they watch you perform in your house, and you put on a great show for them live after they've paid. Uh, there was an artist, a female artist, I can't remember her name, but she made $500. She only had seven followers. She only had seven fans and made $500 because one of the fans wanted her to write down the lyrics to her song and made $500 like that. Now, of course, you got to understand she had a strong rapport and bond with her fans for that to even take place. That's what you need to first do. Um, anyway, so what I'll be doing uh, in the next email is sending you a site that will help you uh, take this idea to the next level. Right now, I just want you to think of different ideas uh, and different experiences you can sell to your fans after building a strong bond with them. You don't need that many fans, but you do need a lot of bond, a lot of rapport, trust, and a strong relationship with those fans. Whatever, how many fans you got. Um, so anyway, I'll be talking to you again soon. If you like the message in this video, give me a thumbs up and a positive comment below. <coughs> and if you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. And uh, I'm exactly prolific. I'll be talking to you again shortly. Peace.